One for the money, two for the show. Three to get ready, and four is how many parts I've recorded, almost, ever since uh, part one. Because of the fact that, as of recording this, part two still hasn't even come out yet. So with that being said, am I recording this? Yes, I am. Hello, everybody. It is me, Janishef. We're back once again with some more GTA 5. I think we're part five at this point, so let's just hop into it. Wait, is this the one that's into sports a lot, or what? I don't... Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, this is the... This is the... The exercising freak, yeah. Not now. Message for me, get off your fat ass. Let's see, this uh, exercise stuff's about as relaxing for you as it is for my wife. No, I don't want to sleep with you, and no, I don't care that I'm 39 and single. It doesn't worry me a bit. Easy. I'm not stressed out at all. Now go fuck yourself. Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. Just fuck you. All of you. Okay. I'm on a run. Mm. Well, you seem a little upset. I could still run you into the fucking ground. <laughs> okay. Hey, I played high school football, all right, sweetheart? All state, QB. Whatever. Just don't have a coronary. Let's go! Huh. Whoa! Oh, boy, here we go. My okay, thing, my problem here. Boobs, race shit at the beach! I don't know who I'm more embarrassed for. You're not exactly dressed for cardio. It's uh, running. How much gear do you need? Well, for starters, though, you're running in flip-flops. Yeah, if your uncle was the same age as you, you mean? Although that would explain a lot. Fuck you! Why are you so angry? I'm not angry! I'm exercising! Run on the road! Take that traffic head on! Yeah, I could have guessed you were one of those. That space is yours! Own it! Screw you, I'm running here! Well, this is just a lot of running, then. <laughs> Sorry about the Neanderthal! The failed shot! This is so tragic! Like, this is my problem, but it says I've run out of stamina. So then what am I supposed to do? Just walk? You have such a joy for life! Like, that's always been my biggest problem with this mission. What the hell am I supposed to do once I run out of stamina? I can hear you weaving! Too early! Classic school boy Can I jump? You and my wife should hang out! Okay, here we go. Last push. Come on, flick the switch, Marianne. Let's go lactic. I thought I had issues, but you, you give me hope. Where's the finish line? My shrink's office is right near uh -oh. here. If you want to work through some of that shit. Yeah, I'm actually losing health. Advertisement for therapy. Please, come on. A little bit further, Michael. A little bit further. We got it. <sighs> Not too shabby, huh? Woo. Have that one on me. I never got out of second gear. I already did a 10k today. Yeah, whatever gets you through it. Oh, my chest. Fuck me. Screw you! You're lucky I'm tapering for a try! Okay. Yes, please. I did it. Woohoo. Yeah, that episode was great. Wow, that really hurt his lungs. Alright, next up, our next stranger is over here. Just me. I got him. Don't make this any worse than it already is. There it is. It's good, news. it's good news. He's dead. Thought you might need this. What a gentleman. And for once, I'm not being sarcastic. Excuse me, what? Oh, this is the. This was a nice car. Oh, th this is the one who's like into drugs and all that, I think. Yeah. He wants marijuana legal. Hang on, wait a minute. Me, sir, can I talk to you for a second? Okay, fine, but I'm low on health. So I'm going to die again. Talking about a hotline straight to heaven. That this state makes illegal. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. I don't give a fuck about reefer. No, no, they rigged the vote. I saw the ballots. It's a lie. It's democracy at work, amigo. Democracy can suck my fatty. Democracy only works when it lets intelligent people do what they want. This? This is tyranny by morons. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, I got things to take care of in a little place called reality. Oh, there goes grab. gravity. Nah, I'm not a drug guy. <sighs> this isn't bushweed. This is mana. I grew up myself. No paranoia, no weirdness. A 
passport to Nirvana. <laughs> yeah, here you hardly feel it. You hardly yeah, feel it. I smoke it. all day and I'm fine. <laughs> it's a pure, mellow high. But I do get concerned about the monsters. The what? Yeah. I mean... I'm sure they're nothing serious, but, uh... Oh. I never let them get to you. Oh! The fuck! <laughs> Why do I have a... Okay, this is a problem. This is a problem, okay. Oh boy. Being at health, health here is not something I... Oh boy, yeah, they're killing me. Oh boy. I don't think my shooting actually should go up when I'm high. Oh boy. So am I, I don't like this. Oh boy. You! Please. No. Stop it. No. No more. Ew. What is that? Ah, jeez, it's you. How many more are there? Are we finished yet? Any more of you freaks out there? Oh. Am I good? Oh, feels so good. I'm good now, right? And after that, you see, the liquor company's push Phew. for continued fluid. I'm okay. Which is complete insanity. <laughs> so I take it I can count on your support. The fuck just happened? What are you talking about? We discuss globalization, the state. Stay the fuck away from me. What? But it's a good cause. <laughs> I was gonna flip him off. I did it. A kill chain. Woohoo! Hey, Snap! You have to help me! This crazy guy's smacking the shit out of his girlfriend! I don't know what to do! I think he's gonna kill her! Okay, no Come problem. On, quick! This way! She was screaming no! And he just kept hitting her! It's just over here! Over here? No problem. We got one! Go, go, get. Excuse me! You fucking moving, you. Oh no! Oh no! What happened? Oh look, free cash though. And a shotgun. Alright, here we go. Is this it? Nope, one more. This is it. Let's just climb over the car. Yeah. <laughs> that was definitely easier. Fuck you, Lester. You gonna let me in or what? Give me a minute. <sighs> there we go. Wow. I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. Guess you weren't very dead. You need my help. Hmm. How do you know? Because you came here. Why else would you? <clears throat> I haven't been a good friend for you, Lester. I know that. And you're gonna make it up to me by doing whatever I ask. Or rather, I, I mean... I need something done, you need to know something, so... Why not help each other? I gotta make some dough. So you're back in the game? I guess. Look, Lester, about what happened before. I know you never mentioned my name. I know I'm not on any lists anywhere. I know you never betrayed me. As for you, you gotta figure that I never told anyone. That instead of gently decomposing in North Yankton, you're angrily decomposing in Los Santos with a shrink and a wife who don't love you no more. Yeah. yeah well, <laughs> since you put it like that. Hey, shut up a minute. I'm getting an eye find alert. Ew. That little college boy sack of shit, phony fuck. Who? Jay Norris? Yes. That fuck is a lying bastard. I've read his fucking emails. He's a fucking cheat. Is this the guy with the phone? Say that he saved America. What, by but outsourcing all the jobs? by selling us little bits of plastic restricted access shit. Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. What the hell are you talking about? You are about to get that white collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here, take this uh, 
fashionably retro weird for a 45 year old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag. There's a lot of hyphens. yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. Okay. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism. And brother, it is gonna be fun. You fucking kidding me? I'm a bank robber, not a web designer. So we'll go robbing soon. I'll find something. Just like the old days. <coughs> Jeez. Alright, I guess I gotta go to Suburban Store in Vinewood. Oh, but now it's suddenly day. Jesus. What time is it again? I forgot. 7.15. I was in there for quite a while if I have to... If it's suddenly daytime. Ah, here we go. I'm just gonna park here. Ah. Excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know. Geeky. Youthful. Lost your job and the world's moved on, huh? That's too bad. I didn't lose my job. I also got a lot of blood of on my shirt. <laughs> Got too old, got outsourced. Same thing happened to my dad. Now you gotta fit in with a different generation. Hmm? What about a vest and some cargo shorts? Not right. too bad. All right, press E to browse these ones. I kind of like seeing him in this, or maybe not this one. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. Good luck at the interview. Bye now. Oh, that's it? Oh, because I'm already wearing a short, so I guess it's working. Michael? I'm all dressed up. Now, you want to run me through this thing? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you look the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine. Hey. Hey. Uh, oh, great. Uh, PM's pushing for more functionality. <laughs> but we are maxed. I mean, if anything, we have to strip features, especially if we plan on releasing a fully yeah. priced update a year later. Oh, my. You know, it's... Yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I mean, we're talking beta in Q4, maybe Q3. Look, milestones are one thing, but when design is changing its mind yeah. seemingly overnight, there's not much you can do about it. You Look, know what I'm saying? Uh, my union allocated smoke breaks bowed up, so... Wait a minute. Do I know you? Yeah, I think so. I... I T-temp, right? Yeah. yeah. Hey, you know, you gotta do something for me. Ah, uh, you gotta put it in a ticket. Uh, no. I'd like to keep this one out of the database, if you know what I mean. Oh, that's right. Invader zone, yoga zone, tech stop, sweat lodge, fire extinguisher. I'm with turning water. consultant when we release. Consulting consulters. Here you go. If well, you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't be a problem. This oh. is a filthy hard drive, bro. Good God. Ah, uh, got any antivirus software? I think so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. And we scan. Scanning. There's so much porn. My glitch fixing is gonna be way down today. <laughs> my son probably wrote this. A little shitbag. And that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, mines are gonna blow. Yes, they are. Oh boy. Well, let's see. Look at this prototype. Oh boy. No privacy. Perfect. Oh, nice. Oh, it still has a plastic back. Oh, wait, no, this was 2013 when they get... Oh, I'm just leaving my bag there? Okay, sure. Sometimes I feel like we're, like, testing the seat to see just how much... Dude, up when it like blue screens up. again, 
You're my guy. Bye. All you had to do was run an antivirus thing. Let me get the door for you. Oh, thank you. Now I gotta watch the keynote there. Where's my car? Hey, Michael. Hold on, hold on. Don't! I dumbed ya! Lester, the thing's in the prototype. I'm going home to watch the keynote. Teabag time, my friend! Lester, did you hear me? Are you playing that game? Yeah, yeah, sorry. The phone is rigged. Hey, what's your problem? You don't like shooters? They're all the same. Besides, you know me. I'm a movie guy. Classic Vinewood. Classic Vinewood ended 30 years ago. Now it's just superheroes, romantic comedies, and remakes. None of which interest me. Hey, I believe this country can still make interesting movies. There's no better way to define American life than a two-hour plot in which the hero looks good and defeats evil. Ah, whatever you say. Enjoy yesterday. Anyway, just call the device after he's unveiled it, and then we'll talk. Whatever happened to tracing calls? <laughs> oh my god, you guys are so lame! Oh. No! I'm watching Fame or Shame! Oh, fucking tits! <laughs> Give me up! <laughs> oh no, you're not gonna watch your show. The most racist oh yeah, hang on. America. Ladies and gentlemen, there it is. Please welcome Mr. Jay Norris to the stage. Hey, so can I pull my phone now or what? This company has Guess come not. a long way since we started it in my parents' pool house in East Carraway. Today, you are about to witness a new phase. Full-on, weapons-grade, red alert, world domination! We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain, and we have milked every penny we could in the process. Yay! We have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years? That's not just impressive, it's revolutionary! Okay. Yeah, I have middle schoolers work on it. Okay. Right here. We are about to make or was it the next freshman? step. Prepare to witness the future. The Life Invader mobile device. Wow. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. Oh. A small, personal, computerized device. Outstanding. Now you're going to be able to stay docked 24-7. On the bus, you can dock. On the subway, stay docked. You can be docked at home. And at the same time, you're docking with some kids at the public pool. Dock, 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 that sounds disgusting. Dock, 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 dock. We went to the guys at Fruit Computers, and we told them we wanted to make our hardware as compatible as possible. But you know what? They're not interested in sharing their technology. So we went and made it compatible anyway. Now you can dock your Life Invader to an iFruit phone or any other device. And it'll take all the data off it and reformat it into Life Invader friendly information. Wait. How do I? At around this point in my presentation, there was meant to oh, for my product team to introduce the device. But we're experiencing some technical difficulties. Uh oh, where is it? I hate to keep you waiting any longer. Sorry. Oh, hold on a second. I think someone's trying to talk with me. Hello? Oh, oh. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Whoa. Let's... Whoa. Like, I was trying to pull up my phone. I just didn't know when. Oh, yeah, sorry. I had to wait for the phone to be pulled out first. That was my mistake. Oh, uh, yay. Ah, I waited too long. Oh, do you think I completed those pop-ups fast enough? <laughs> I have no bars. How am I making this call? <laughs> Last. 
That was heavy. Are you watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know, the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look. I don't know how to trade stocks. <laughs> I took one semester of economics and that's it. <laughs> oh, the man. Don't touch me! Oh, you don't have to call to tell me that. Uh -huh. Not you, the Dieter Sachs store detective. There's been a misunderstanding. I need you to help clear it up. Fine. Oh, now you want me. All right, I'm coming. The one phone call rule is for real policemen, you wordless turd. Great. You had that opportunity. I said get off me, you stupid bastard. I told you, she's a biter. That's assault on top of the shoplifting beat. Man, the paperwork. What do I do? What Just... you packing? You know, stick. He's got my car! Shit! Ow, ow. Let's go! Drive, ow. Michael! Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Gone? Of course they're gone. Who are you talking to? Come on, I'll take you back to the house. Hello? Hello? No seatbelts? Don't say it! What? That I have everything I want, so why am I stealing? Oh, my lips are sealed. Because if you say that, I'll say the same to you. I'm not saying anything. I'm just doing my best to keep us out of jail. Can we drive home, please? I mean, who are you? To judge me. Oh, I'm not judging? No, not at all. You're loving this, are you? Oh, yeah. Risking prison, getting shot at. Love, love, big love. What a happy so marriage. This is what it's like to be you. Uh, not really, honey. See, I'm a semi successful crook. You're a bit of a failure, but hey, kudos for trying. Not that successful if you're in witness protection. Well, I've got an idea. Why don't we see what Agent Dave and the FIB think of this Lovers on the Run act? Where are you going? I'm here. You know, I'm sort of thankful for this. Thankful? This is the worst day of my life. Get rid of the car, Michael. It can't stay in the driveway. Oh, and yeah. Thank you. Yeah, sure. No problem. Now I wish you got arrested. Oh, uh, so just mission passed. Oh, cats. Oh my god, I want a cat. What the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Oh, okay. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. Now, they say it cannot be hit. Hasn't been yet. Look. I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martín Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Well, gems it is then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, he went quiet. I think that's a reference, but I'd, I wouldn't know. I've only played GTA V. So. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. Oh, am I driving? All right, I have to be driving. Here we go. Oh, thank God, I somehow also brought my car is here. On Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business? FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. 
Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. Well, for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Here we are. Dang, look at these glasses. You reading me? Mm-hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. I want you to peek inside me. What? <laughs> Wait, I thought you liked it when I talked dirty. Hello? Hello? <laughs> what? Sir, thank you. Thank the you. alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Alarm, vents, and cameras, get some shots! Oh, damn. Glasses are live, shoot away. Alright, what do we got here? Uh, surveillance and ventilation. Now all I'm after is the alarm. This shot is useless. Hey, oh, this alarm. Hang on. The shot of the alarms come through. Hey, beautiful. <laughs> That's what you meant. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Ooh. Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe 10 grand. Our rings start at 8, our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. Ooh. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around. Think about it. Come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come oh, boy. Okay. Thank you, sir. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. Okay. Find an access point to the rooftop. You got it. Look, there. Some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. Alright, you stay in there, Lester. Don't go anywhere. Please excuse us while we... Okay. So, you keep up with the old crew? Well, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to, uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD, shootout, maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway? They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. Where? Oh, there. <laughs> I'm on the roof. All right, use the glasses to get me a shot of Angelico's roof unit. It'll be right above the store. Oh, get to the high ground, Anakin. Okay. Oh, uh, I forgot. Was it this place? We need to know where those vents come out. Okay. Hey, I see the vents. Oh, yeah, this. I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. Oh, there. Okay. You got it. You've got a good vantage. Now use it and get an image of the air system. This? Is it, uh, this thing? No, no. The air conditioning roof unit. Oh, this thing. Okay. Capture an image of the system and we're <laughs> done. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. I'm an idiot. Okay, that'll do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. Will do. Go, go, go. Go. If you take any longer, you're risking blowing this whole thing. Hang on, I can only walk so fast. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. 
So, what did you see? Oh, you don't see me driving? Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe them remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes who rub his nose in it. Uh, good. The alarm system's linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window if someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Mm, glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof. Means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open, then? Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. I might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. <laughs> oh, you're gonna turn daytime? Nope. Here are the photos. Oh, I didn't say uh, thank you. Workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't want to leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options. I'm showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions. That is your domain, my friend. Here. Wow. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LSP tactical team so one of their vans is probably a good place to look a hacker can disable the cameras the length of time depends on their ability the alarm will be operating on the same window the exit strategy is more or less the same for both options the driver you pick will of course source some bikes you come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the del perro freeway you lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the ls river all right i want my guy franklin on the getaway he can handle a bike. All right. If you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. All right. So how do you want to do this? Run into the front door or try to play it smart? Oh. Die or play it smart. Yeah, and uh, one of the self and the other's high impacts make the choice. I'd rather be ah, smart. You've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now That's the driver, fair. they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Okay, so this is, uh, the driver. So I got 14 and 8. You know what? That's okay. I'll just, I will willing to give him more of the cut. Eddie Toe. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. You know, I really care too much for money anyways. I've always kind of wanted to see what happens if I just get, like, the best of the best. Gus Moda. He's a pro, not much else to say. Hacker, back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. And go, Paris. guys. <laughs> good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. That look good to you? Are you sure? All right, let's see here. So 28% plus another 15, 38, 43% of my cut's already gone. And again, like I mentioned before, I'm not one for spending a lot of money in this game anyways until like the end. Because like they, they give me what I've got and like so be it. So I think I am you got good. I, I'm good at Lester. I'm Great. deciding. I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas and I'll be in touch. Uh, yes, huh? good, good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what? My rep don't count for nothing no more. You're a dead man, Mike. Oh, right, he is. I'll call you. 
Whoa. That was terrible. Hey, what's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um, I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down, so well, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful and the risk will be high, but you might learn something if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog. but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you could put together your own deals, your own jobs. So, there's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. All right. And as we're driving back to Michael's safe house, I think we're gonna call it an episode. I've been recording for almost an hour at this point, which is going to be a decent amount of footage to watch through, you know, but that'll be it. I don't know why I'm going with that, so I'm just going to say thank you all so much for watching this episode of GTA 5. Or this part, I guess. Oh, I got another call. Hang on. I guess I can't end this episode yet. Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do is your business, bro. Anyway, Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. And I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. Highest crew member, Ricky Lukens unlocked. Okay. All right. Can I get? One? Can I do my outro now? Am I gonna do my outro now? Oh, hang on. Bugs always have some vans in their warehouse. Sl steal Jenna a. Keeps okay. Trying to steal my car. You really need to get him one. Okay. Have fun. His security Is and. Is peace and quiet too much to ask for? Can I do my outro, please? Am I good now? Please just let me do my outro. Come on. All right. So, with that being said, now finally, thank you all so much for watching this part. Like or comment, subscribe for the next one, which you know I'll be probably most likely doing another pre-recording again. So you know, I'll catch y'all in the next one. <laughs> See y'all then. Farewell.